So if you watched yesterday's vlog, you may notice that it's um bright outside, not really early in the morning. Good morning, audience. <laughs> Uh, so yesterday we talked about the fact that we were supposed to get up really super early this morning and we were going to go somewhere and we were going to pick something up. Yeah, at about 11.30, almost midnight last night, Jamie and I decided we weren't going. We're like, you know, something just doesn't feel right. For those of you that guessed what it was, it was a new Jeep. We were looking at a new Jeep to replace my Jeep and uh, we changed our mind at the last minute and decided we didn't want to drive all the way down to Fort Wayne, Indiana which was, you know, it was, what was it? It would have been five and a half hours to get down there, probably about two hours while we were down there, and then five and a half hours to get back, which wasn't the bad part, because Jamie and I have done long trips like that before, not really a big deal, but I don't know. The dealer, the guy that was working with me, was very arrogant and rude, and I just, like, even this morning after I texted him and I said, we're not coming down today, he texted me back like 10 minutes later, he said, oh, well, the Jeep sold, which, it's still on their website, so I highly doubt it is. But he was just very arrogant and very pushy and very rude, which I've dealt with car dealerships before, and some guys are really, really nice, and some guys or girls are really, really nice, and some are just jerks. And this guy was just a jerk. So we decided he was a jerk, and I didn't care if I wanted the Jeep. I wasn't going to go down there and spend time with somebody that was going to make me upset. So we decided we're not going. What? So we'll find another one. I, we just still don't know if we're going to go for a diesel or if we're gonna go for another V8 Grand Cherokee like I have now. We haven't really decided yet. Kind of been looking a little bit this morning. Shelby's still outside. Shelby was just outside with your daddy. You wanna go outside and see Shelby? Let's go see her. Let's go, wanna go see Shelby? Let's go see her. Shelby's like, hey guys, I'm out here all alone. Could you, could you let me in? Do you want in or out? This one's coming out. You wanna stay out? You wanna come in? In? You wanna stay out or you wanna come in? In? You, okay. You girls cracked me up. <laughs> A good friend of mine is now the animal control officer for our county and in the past few months that she's uh, few months that she's been the new animal control officer she has done multiple hoarding situations of cats i believe this is now the fourth one that she has done and it's uh they they're calling it tabby nation and i am gonna go see the kitties even though i can't adopt one i'm gonna go see the kitties anyway so we're gonna go to tabby nation at the Alpena County Animal Control Building and check out these cats who sadly have about two weeks to all be adopted or else the really sad thing that has to happen has to happen and that's mainly because she's already done three other cat hoarding situations and she has no place left to take these cats so if you're in Michigan if you're in northern Michigan and you're looking to adopt a cat uh, reach out to I will put links down below to the uh, animal Alpena County Animal Control Facebook page and to uh, Shelly Shelly Olry's shelter in Hillman uh, if you're looking to get a cat so let's go see some kitties <laughs> Nation. There's 31 cats total. They were taken from a hoarding situation. Some of them are really, really friendly. Some of them are still really, really scared. 
hopefully they will find some homes. One of them did get adopted tonight and there was another guy there that was potentially looking at taking one or two of them. So that's good. Like I said, if you're anywhere near us and you want to adopt a kitty, there's like at least 30 left that need homes. And they really only have about, where'd you go? A week left. So we hopefully need to find them homes. Or you know, if any of you guys are work that work with cat rescues, maybe in the Michigan area, comment, let me know. Maybe we can get some more of these cats into some rescues. As I was saying earlier, most of the rescues that our animal control has been working with really has, uh, because of all the other hoardings, they've exhausted all their space. And our local shelter isn't taking any because drama. I mean, yeah, because drama. So, yeah, it sucks because a lot of those cats are super friendly and super adoptable. I mean, they've all got issues, but they're super friendly. So, that's Tabby Nation. Maybe this video will help a couple more of them get adopted. Seriously, do you think if you stay sitting there long enough that eventually food will just magically appear on the table and you can eat it? Or do you just really want to channel your inner peoples? I'm channeling my inner peoples. I'm totally a peoples. <laughs> yeah. yeah, come on, get down, you cutie patootie. Shelby, did you want to eat your biscuit with all of your toys? You have both red balls close to you and you have all of the toys. <laughs> she had a biscuit and she came over here and laid down. Is that the good, is that the good spot? I think you ate it all, honey. You ate all. You ate it all. Was it delicious? Are you happy in all those toys? Yeah. You're so weird. <laughs> Oakley, come here. Come here, Oakley. Come here. Right here. here. <laughs> she like kind of is like peeking around come the here, corner. Oakley. She's like, wait. Come here. Oakley just woke up from a nap. Literally. Oh, nice. See, I got food. Oh, there's a cookie? Oh, I like cookies. Here, you want a cookie? I guess you it's have... fish, not really. Yeah, you have to go outside. Like come on, let's go outside. You didn't go outside earlier because you were napping. All right, come She's on. like, I just want the fish. <laughs> come on, let's go outside. I can't, I can't see it. Can He's up there. Camera? I don't think I can get him on camera. Is that a hornet? He's huge. Yeah. All black with white antennas. He's about. I don't want to get close. I would like to not. He's up right there. Oh God. Is. You guys see him? No, oh, he's over there now. I feel like that could take down a large animal. <laughs> oh, look at Memphis. Shake that tree. Shake that limb for her. Get it. Get it, Memphis. I know. Get it. We said it's okay. You can get it. You can get it. Get it, yeah, good girl. Get it. Get it. Is this why you like catching trees? Huh? When you drive get it. Get it, Memphis. Jump. Jump. Get it. Jump. <laughs> the way she looks at it. Oh, and she almost got it! Oh, now she sees that there's an apple she can grab. She's like, oh, that one's got an apple. Oh, 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 <laughs> oh two oh, apples! They both fell off at you. Oakley, we got you an apple. Ouch, I hit my head on an apple. Oakley, <laughs> here. Here you go. Oh, that's a big one. Yeah, you gotta pull it. Okay, wait, yeah, hold on. Wait. All right, here. No, 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 take that one. <laughs> Here you go. Well, now you don't want it? Isn't that good enough? How about you? Okay, you take it and go do your thing. Oakley probably wants this little one. You want the little one instead? Yep, how did I know? What are you going to do with it? Gee, I bet we know what you're going to do with it. <laughs> Memphis dropped hers. Oh, are you going to take it over there? Uh, maybe? You could try to eat it? I don't know. You're so cute. Oh, here she goes. I thought you were seriously going to jump up there on your own. You're silly. She's like, whoa, wait. Oh, it smells better now. She's like, just get me a piece off, would you? Hey, thanks. <laughs> mm -hmm. That one might be too small. Might be a little bitter. <laughs> <laughs> All right, back it's to the like, frog. hmm, this is good. I found a frog. I see my shadow. It's I'm gonna right try to get close to him. Shelby's behind me. Don't let her eat him. See him? There's a frog. Don't jump, Mr. Frog. 
Shelby will eat you. <laughs> I don't know if Shelby will, but Memphis will. And that's actually a frog, not a toad. Yeah. Pretty cool. Memphis has that apple and she's now playing with it all by herself. See if she'll do it again now that she knows I'm watching her. Watch her, she'll pick it up and throw it. <laughs> She won't play with dog toys, barely ever. But you give her an egg. Look at her tail go. This is fun. I like this. This, this is my new friend. <laughs> so Jamie is starting a project. <laughs> yeah, we're going to find out what this is. But I have to get this off, I think, in order to get it out. Slide all that. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. We think that that might be parts to a swing. Actually, now that I think about it, I might be able to just angle them out. You think it's just the frame part yeah, and not the... One. Oh yeah, maybe. Well, I was going to do it last uh, summer because it was on a decent day, but the birds were out here, so we kind of had to wait till... Wow, Shelby. Shelby's kicking up dust. Oh gosh, can you see it? Yeah, kicking up dust. And Memphis is now eating the apple she was playing with. And Oakley just buried an apple, but I think Shelby's helping her bury it more. Yeah, so we think that there's a possibility that that's a swing. Yeah. Hmm, we'll find out. It's kind of the start of the project. I'm sure it'll go into another day as well. Your face is dirty. I totally forgot to say goodnight last night. So, a couple things. One, at about 5 o'clock today, the day you're watching this video over at youtube.com slash gone to the snow dogs, we will be doing a live show. So if you want to check that out. And then, two, the Tabby Nation. The cats that you guys saw earlier in the video, like I said, there will be links down below. And hopefully some of those sites will have more information on what we can do to help. So part of the problem we have right now is those cats are with Animal County Animal Control, not our local shelter. Our local shelter apparently isn't taking any of them. And the way our animal control is set up is they're not a nonprofit. We're working on making like a Friends of Alpena County Animal Control so we can help take donations and help take help them with animals and things like that. But so far that's not happening as of yet. So Shelly Olry's shelter is doing the applications for the cats. So you can make donations to Shelly Olry's cat shelter and tell them that you want it to go towards the Alpina cats. Maybe that'll work. I'm not sure. Either way, I gotta end this video. If you're new to this channel and you like what you saw, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like this video, and share it with your friends to help us grow the audience. As always, you guys, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive, dream big, and we'll see you again on... Monday, because today's Friday. You might get a Saturday video. I'm not sure. We're we have a wedding to go to, so we'll see. Good night, audience. Thanks for liking and subscribing to Snow Dogs Vlog.